Before we move on to the next color step, I want to go ahead and assemble the knuckle plate while the piece is still damp and pliable from the die and the finish. You can also perform this step before applying the color if you wish, but avoid assembling the piece while it's completely dry. I'll be using the Iwata Eclipse HP CS airbrush for some of the future tutorials, but it's better for dye gradients and detail work. I could certainly airbrush all of the pieces with this airbrush, but it would take a while. When building armor suits, you really have to shift your thinking on how you do things because there's a lot of parts and a lot of space to cover.